Oh god. It's extra broken now. Howdy folks, welcome on back to you, me, and the movies. And it's time for a good one. Our Patreon voters voted on this one. The Departed from Martin Scorsese. Okay. All-star cast. Everybody you know is in this movie. Perfect. Or everybody in this movie is somebody you know. It's cops versus mobsters. Modern day mob. Tense thriller drama. It's going to be a lot of fun. Well, all right. Why haven't you seen this, though? Don't know anything about it. Yeah. The Departed also sounds kind of ominous. Yeah. Kind of sounds like a scary movie. Yeah. Yeah. Or people that people that are dying, airplane. people that are dying, or something. Okay. So, what are you expecting? Have you seen any other of Martin Scorsese's great movies like Casino? I have not seen Casino. I feel like I've probably seen a Scorsese movie, but okay. I don't know what they are. We we'll have to look at his library and see what other movies from him we've got to watch. Yeah, so. all right. But this is the one we're watching today. So, should we just jump right into it? Might as well. Let's do it. But first, like, comment, and subscribe. Come on, and hang out. We're going to keep watching this stuff. Yeah, have some fun. Check out our Patreon link if you want early access to our videos, full and commentaries, or vote like the voters did today to pick this movie. The link's down below. Check it out. Let's watch The Departed. Boston, some years ago. So descriptive. 20 years after an Irishman couldn't get a f***ing job, we had the presidency. May rest in peace. No one gives it to you. You have to take it. Don't make me have to come down here again for this. Won't happen again, Mr. C. Oh, that's the voice. I'm like, it sounds so familiar. Carmen's developing into a fine young lady. You should be proud. You get your period yet, Carmen. Oh, jeez. creep. You ever want to earn a little extra money? Come by L Street. So this is about an Irish mob, not the Italian mob. Good old Irish mob. Okay. I don't know about Irish mobs. I mean, I don't know much about Italian mobs either, <laughs> but... <laughs> Jeez. She fell funny. <laughs> Francis, you really should see somebody. <laughs> criminals. Today, what I'm saying to you is this. When you're facing a loaded gun, what's the difference? Hey. It's my boy. Yeah. So she tells me, you never finish anything. You finish the police course, get taken care of again, baby. So after graduation, I get a blowjob again. <laughs> hey, your mother must be a wonderful woman. <laughs> What is it? Thank you, Frank. A uh, pen. I <laughs> no more pencils, no more books. So it is a pen? No. <laughs> Congratulations on passing the detective's exam and welcome to the Special Investigation Unit. I whooped you f***ing do. We won't be working together. That is, directly. You'll be working for Captain Ellaby, but I like to see Mark you. Wahlberg and Matt Damon? I'm gonna get him confused the whole time. <laughs> you rise fast. Like a 12-year-old. Thank you, Sergeant. My pleasure. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Good luck. Yeah, this is crazy. Like, every famous actor ever is in this movie. <laughs> sir, yes, sir, I have an idea. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Let's say you have no idea and leave it at that, okay? I have an idea about what we do. We would not be good at what we do, would we? We were calling us Staff Sergeant Dignam has a style of his own. I'm afraid we all have to get used to it. <laughs> I got a question. How f by you? I don't know. I don't understand the connection yet, but I'm sure it's coming. Behavior. And what's this got to do with me, huh? Why are you pretending to be a cop? Oh, I get it. The guy that seems totally clean and normal, but he's actually the dirty cop. Leonardo DiCaprio, the one you would think would be the dirty cop because of his family history, is going to be the clean cop, right? Family's all criminals except for the old man, huh? And one priest, since you seem to know everything. Oh, last I heard, he was happily married to a 12-year-old boy living on a beach in Thailand. Ooh. I'm the best friend you have on the face of this earth, and I'm going to help you understand something, you punk. You're no f***ing car. Five years from now, you could be anything else in the world, but you will not be a Massachusetts state trooper. 
Ooh. There's a great view of the State House, Beacon Hill, if you can see it. I mean, you move in, you're upper class by about Tuesday. Is he gonna try and steal that dome or something? Because it's made of gold? Or, like, why does he keep State looking House. at it? Amen. May her soul and the souls of all the faithful departed, through the mercy of God, rest in peace. The faithfully departed. So it is gonna be a lot about deaths, huh? F. Costello, Frank Costello. He's the, he's Jack. Jack, Jack. You'll be convicted of a crime. We're thinking a guilty plea to assault and battery would make sense. You'd do enough jail time to convince anyone this is no setup. You'd be on. You want to serve the Commonwealth? This is your chance. It's like deep, deep, deep undercover cop sort of situation. I went through a flogging Molly stage in college. <laughs> I mean, still good. Cranberry juice. My girlfriend drinks it when she's got her period. What do you get, your period? You know me? No. But I'm the guy that tells you there are guys you can hit and there's guys you can't. Now, that's not quite a guy you can't hit, but it's almost a guy you can't hit. <laughs> so I'm right now. You don't f***ing hit him. You understand? What are you drinking? Cranberry juice. What is it, your period? <laughs> Get him a cranberry juice. Hey, f it. it's Jackie's nephew. <sighs> what? Oh, f what? Yeah. <laughs> you just became a guy you can hit. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Give Iraqi Navy. F yourself. I'm tired for f wife. How's your mother? Good, she's tired for f my father. Good. Today, go. <laughs> oh, you're a f genius, huh? Who forged your transcript? F head? Hey, this guy's uh, his old man runs the Hibernian liquor mod, Kenefix. Normally, he's a very uh, nice guy. <laughs> Don't judge him from this meeting alone. <laughs> <laughs> you making a house call? Have I seen you professionally? No, no. Well, yeah, they don't run Hobbit at night, last time I checked. When, when's the last time you checked? Before I went to f topic. <laughs> <laughs> I'll stab someone in the heart with a face pick if it gets me dinner with you. <laughs> no, no, that's all right. I'm a detective. I'll find you. No, sir, I'm just joking. I need to go. <laughs> Very smooth, too. Madeline Madden. He's working hard for that undercover, right? Like, jeez. Yeah, they got this, but they don't get Duck LaRange. Was your meal okay? Yeah, no, no, the lobster was good. I just, you know, because it was a French restaurant. I'm yeah. surprised. <laughs> yeah, I do. Yeah, if you actually do, I'll see you again. Who says I want to see you again? <laughs> don't you? <laughs> you should see your face. <laughs> I'll just arrest innocent people. Man, you are trouble. Oh, no, you don't know the half of it. I'll arrest you right now. <laughs> Those guys you tuned up, they're connected down Providence. What they're gonna do is come back with some guys and kill you. Which, sure as you're born, they will do. Unless I stop them. Oops. Do you want me to stop them? Is this something I can't do personally? <laughs> Show me your arm. Flip it. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ah! Ooh, ah! God. It's extra broken now. Anyway. Ah! Are you still a cop? No! No! Swear no! on your mother's grave, ah! you're still not a cop! I am not a cop! Ah! Are you gonna stop doing coke deals with your jerk off? Cousin! Yes, yes! Oh, yeah. All right, all right. All right. If you're okay, you'll be all right. Just kidding. How's your mother? Oh, uh, she's on her way out. You all are. Act accordingly. <laughs> the point I'm making with John Lennon is 
A man could look at anything and make something out of it. French. Put it downstairs, here, and thank you. Maybe we could work something out. Good. And uh, send this to his wife. That was quick. I think he's dead already? We have to do it by phone. I won't do it if I have to wear a wire. No wires ever, you understand? You don't know what wear a wire the whole time. Yeah, yikes. Oops. <laughs> Jimmy Bags. He was re. I don't know. What the f are you doing? <laughs> we think Costello's got a rat in the state police. Really? So his job is to uh, find out about himself task force he just yeah. put together yeah. just to find the rat which is him exactly <laughs> your uncle jackie he also would kill my entire family if he saw me here with you and i think about this so what the f are we talking about here <laughs> <laughs> how's sister mary Teresa doing had a tasty relationship before she took her vows enjoy your clams cocksuckers oh, damn <laughs> what was the dirty thing? Was it a dirty thing? Yeah, it was just a dirty. I didn't get doodle. to see it. I love a good dirty doodle. What were you looking at if you didn't see it? Well, it just was so fast. It was just. Thank you. So, do you want to talk about last night? You know, it's all right. Guys tend to make too big a deal out of it. No, oops. It's actually quite common. I gotta go to work. What happened last night? <laughs> I have no idea. So you had a parent who was a drunk? Did you? No. Let's keep it with you. <laughs> I ain't gonna hurt you. Do you see cops? That's part of what I do. I mean, I normally don't see cadets who've been kicked out of the academy. Oh boy, you should get a better job, huh? Should I? <laughs> so what, what was it like for you in jail? You wanna hear about the showers? Is that what you wanna did, hear about? Did something happen to you? <laughs> no. I think Costello's got a spy inside the Special Investigation Unit. You, you, you serious? I'm afraid so. Why don't you just give me a bottle of scotch and a handgun to blow my f***ing head off? Are we done here with this psychiatry bullshit? You, know, you what, can what leave. The f I just put myself through. I'm out of here. Why is the last patient of the day always the hardest one? It's because you're tired and you don't give a. Shit. It's not supernatural. Listen. <laughs> so you want to get a cup of coffee? That seems like a bad idea. <laughs> Our target is a major transaction of microprocessors. Yes, those. I don't know what they are. You don't know what they are. Who gives a cash? <laughs> this lead came from Queen is undercover guy. I'm gonna have a smoke right now. You want to smoke? You don't smoke, do you? Right? What do you want? All those fitness freaks, huh? Go <laughs> we have a blind spot. Why do we have a blind spot? We had two hours notice. You think this is NASA? Oh, it never crossed my mind. Have you got a camera in the back? What back? <laughs> Kids, none of us are carrying automatic weapons. Because here, in this country, it don't add inches to your <laughs> You get a life sentence for it. This is unbelievable. Who put the f cameras in this place? Oh, who the f you? I'm the guy who does his job. You must be the other guy. <laughs> He's so aggressively just an asshole, right? <laughs> Cars are moving. Did you see anybody come out? Please tell me those cars aren't empty. I mean, Jesus Christ, please tell me that those Chinamen's cars aren't empty! Oh, there's a back. <laughs> Did you put a camera in the back? Can I talk to you for a second, please? Stupid. Oh, 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 o
Don't people have doubts and problems? Mm. Well, not problems, but doubts. You don't usually have doubts. Not this week. Forget the phone. Got it. Answer it. Answer it. Just push the the end button on, on it. Hello. What the f is it with you and your phone? Huh? Nothing. 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 It went dead. I don't know. I, I guess was that that shrink that answered the phone. Remember, I told you. Jeez. Yeah. Do you like little miss things sucking on your? <laughs> yes. <laughs> we got a cop. Crew. Yeah, I know. I'm kind of getting that feeling too. He's one of yours. Don't disappoint me on this. Or some other guy will be putting their fat <laughs> up little Miss Freud's ass. What is she thinking? She's like, wow, this is weird. <laughs> I'm living with a man I have known nothing about. We arrested some Chinese government guys at the border carrying some light sockets or something. <laughs> <laughs> Now I do. What the f you do? What? I gotta pay Costello and wait for him to trade me to the FBI? Because that's what he does. Oh my god, is that French out there? Right. Well, just tell me what you just said. Forget it. I'm high. I'm high. I must be high. I would never say what you thought. I say what you. Oh! Ooh, ouch. Costello's a protected FBI informant. He'll trade you out. I thought I was supposed to go into the shock. I'm not in shock. It fing hurts. <laughs> I thought I was supposed to go in shock. Do you think he's a FBI informant? That would be one f***ing twist, wouldn't it? <laughs> Want some coke? There it is. Oh, jeez. Where did he put it? The coke? Yeah. Or Little Jack. <laughs> Bank account numbers. I don't have a bank account. I'm a cash business myself. What's he doing, setting up IRAs? Just fill the fuck. <laughs> I don't know if this is how you spell citizens, but what the f it, you know? No, 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 come here. What, are you f***ing or something? That ain't f***ing right. <laughs> Thought she already moved. She's probably still packing up stuff. You don't have any cats. No. <laughs> I like that. <laughs> uh oh. Well, whoopsie. Who does she pick now? Candidates. You have an immaculate record. Some people don't trust a guy with an immaculate record. I do. I have an immaculate record. <laughs> Marriage is an important part of getting ahead. Let's people know you're not a ho Married guy seems more stable. <laughs> Jesus. Ladies see the ring, they know immediately you must have some cash and your c must work. <laughs> That's working. <laughs> Overtime. Except for that one time. <laughs> you think that what it was that one that? What else could it have been? Maybe you cried or something. <laughs> <laughs> See anything you like, Carl? I'm gonna shot you. I mean, you're not indulging in self abuse. It's like this. Any cop could see it. Jesus. If this is such a bad idea, why'd you show up? I own the place. I'm <laughs> surprised. <laughs> I gotta find myself. You're telling me, Sonny Boy. <laughs> Queenan is compartmentalizing. He's splitting everything up. All right, he's fucking not. You know this. I can get the rat. You just. I'm gotta... feeling very anxious about this. He had his ringer on? No way he had his ringer on. He had a text message in that movie theater and it didn't ring.
Oopsies. Yeah, you can totally make that out. Needs <laughs> that enhance button. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Magical enhance. Enhance. Smell a rat. Oh no. That is what brings you down this business. Stupid, huh? Well, I guess that leaves me out. <laughs> You know, past days, situations like this, I kill everybody. Everybody that works for me. Right. You know, Frank, I, uh, I look around at your other guys. You accuse me once. I put up with it. You accuse me twice. I quit. You pressure me to fear for my life. And I will put a f***ing bolt in your head as if you were anybody else. Okay? got something you want to ask me? You're 70 years old, Frank. I'm just saying, okay? One of you guys is going to pop you. Heavy lies the crown. Sort of thing. Yeah. Yeah, something like that. Do it, thing. You do it. You got that? I got it. Okay. Excuse me, uh, French. I got my... Okay, Francis. Eat something. What do you think? Oh, I don't know. It made me feel very uncomfortable. <laughs> like Frank's onto him? Or is yeah. He teasing him? Well, I think he's teasing him, but I think he might be onto him also. Follow Costello. You'll find his rat. Look, if we're not going to make it, it's got to be you that gets out. Because I'm not capable. Did he tell her? No. I think he just wants to get out of the city before he gets too deep in his own shit. See that guy over there? Yeah. Right over there. Yeah. He's not paying attention to us. He's a cop. <laughs> oh, okay. You get it now, do you? <laughs> she ignored us, so she must be a cop. She's probably the <laughs> police commissioner. She's <laughs> <laughs> uh oh. You can get out of here. Using a new crew tonight, new guys. Jimmy, out the back. Bring them up. These guys who answer the questions right, but these guys that don't. In a pail. You're a artist, you're a cop. <laughs> We're guessing who cops are. You know, most good looking women are cops. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going home, all right? Listen, I need to see you today. No, 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 today. You heard nothing about drugs. Oh. Nothing about new guys. And I would have. That information would have come to me. <sighs> it ain't Bill. No way, he says. Yeah, this is Sergeant Sullivan. I want constant surveillance on Captain Queenan, starting right now. He's using the captain's advice to do his Costello work. Is there any reason you would have a tail? No. Because I think Billy, Billy, I don't have you a have tail. You have a tail, though. I'm going to tell you something. Sooner or later, he's going to find out who I am, and he's going to f***ing kill me. I think we got him. I think Queenan's meeting with him right now. Yeah. yeah. Billy, where the f*** are you? We've been trying to reach you. We found the rat. Listen, we're going to take him out. Now look it. The address is 314 Washington Street. You got it? Oh, Christ. It's too late. Let's go back up. You gotta get out of here. Take the fire escape. What about you? I'll be fine, but if you can made, I can't protect you. Now go, go. <gasps> oh no. Whoa, what the f? Oh! What was that? Fuck. Fuck. Oh, fuck. What the fuck's going on? I came to me. What the Get in the bar! I don't know what the
Well, what do you think of that? This d**k's got lots of dead bodies on his hand now. Well, I guess only one dead body, I guess, but... Work with the tech guys to unlock those files. Dig them, take a leave of absence. Take a leave of what? Cleaning is dead. I'm your boss now. I don't give a f**k. I'd rather hand in my papers first. World needs plenty of bartenders. Two weeks with pay. Good. When I called you, hmm? I, I made a mistake. I, I gave you... The wrong address. Yeah. You showed up at the right one, didn't you? Tell me why I didn't tell nobody, huh? <gasps> oh, Jesus. Why didn't he tell anybody? Guys, he's, he's a rat too? I... You killed the guy who had all the information. Now Dignam's gone. Forget about him. He resigned. Don't give a f about Dignam. Oh, bad Irish piss hand. He's so hot for me, we give him a whiff of my ass, he'll crawl right in it. I'll take care of it. Sweetheart. You're giving me a heart, huh? Are you sure it's me? Not all that talk about whiffing and crawling up asses. <laughs> Jeez, what is her deal? She can be honest with him. I can't be a friend of you. One of those situations where her heart tells her one thing and her head is telling her another. Call this number on a dead guy's phone. Who are you? Thank God you're all right. We were very worried. Who are you? We need you to come in. Can you come in? Or meet me. Police have confirmed that the body of the man found dead in the Fenway marshes yesterday afternoon is that of Timothy Delahunt, an undercover policeman for the city of Boston. Tell me how they find them so far. Somebody walking a f***ing dog in three feet of mud. What kind of f size of dog is that? I <laughs> spent all f***ing night doing it, man. I'm embarrassed. <laughs> the cops are saying he's a cop. So I won't look for the cop. And you soft fits. When I tell you to dump a body in the marsh, you dump him in the marsh. Not where some guy from John Hancock goes every Thursday to get a f***ing blowjob! <laughs> Don't laugh! <laughs> this ain't reality TV! Was he really a cop, you think? I think maybe. Around, huh? I think maybe he was. Or was he an FBI informant that they said was a cop? Oh, that could be. That could be. Oh, I don't know. This is... Whew. A lot of twists and turns here. Queenan's guy. He called me when he found out Queenan was dead. I'm running You're him. running him. You give him to me. No, no, I can give you Costello's destination. You know where he's going. Yes, and what he's doing. So get rid of the tail, get special ops on standby. We'll take this prick tonight. All right, let's go now. Is oh, he going to give him up? All right, it's the warehouse he owns over on Sheffield. He's got to have a container or a truck or something there. Go, 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 go. We use having second doubts, trying to get out, right? Matt Damon's character, trying to get out. Maybe he's seizing this opportunity and just going to... End it? Yeah. Load it. We're going to catch him doing on a drug charge instead of this processor charge or something. And... How's this end? 
They decide to take him out together, huh? Frank. Frank. Do they know about me? Leo's gonna catch him. He's gonna be like, look, this is your freaking rat in the police department, right? All that murdering and f***ing and no sons. Dead yet? Yeah, I think he got him. I got him! I got Costello here! Nah, it's, it's, he's been waiting here a long time for you. I just want you to know I'll be recommending you for the Medal of Merit. Oh, yeah? Yeah. It's kind of like a gold star around here, huh? Being a cop's not an identity. I want my identity back. Listen, Bill, I gotta run this in the other room. This computer's getting all friggin' bluey on me. Give me two minutes, I'll have you out of here in no time. What you doing? I don't know, nothing good. Now what? I don't know. I've gotta give you something. Something I need you to keep from me. You open this if something happens to me, or if I call you and I tell you to open it. Whatever you have to say, think about it real hard, all right? If you still want to tell me, you tell me in two weeks, okay? Hopefully he's still alive in two weeks. Oh, jeez. Really? She's pregnant? Oh no. Yeah. <laughs> and they, they say that this little speck is it Costigans, his yeah, I know. Uh oh. Yeah. What the f is it? What? What? Just listen to some Pearl Jam. I got a cop. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm kind of getting that feeling, too. You know what? I thought I was the liar. Hey, I can explain that! Mm. Three o'clock. Where Queen and died, you keep your cell on. Going through your head. She's gonna run away from him as fast as she can. Think so? I hope Didn't so. Didn't we already talk about this? This is my job! She's packing her bag right now. She's also praying that it's the other guy's baby. Hey, 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 put the gun down. You erase me, huh? Oh, yeah, go ahead, shoot a cop, Einstein. Watch what happens. Well, what happened is this bull would go right through your head. Watch what happens. What, so you can get the parade, huh? The bagpipes and bull you, I'm arresting you. That's the stupidest thing you could do. Oh. Shut the up. I could give a the charges don't stick. I'm still arresting you. Drop your weapon and step away from Sergeant Sullivan. I called you. You, you know who I am. I'm taking him down. I'm taking him downstairs now. Just put your gun away. You know who I am. Put your gun away and walk him downstairs. I can't wait to see you explain this to a Suffolk County jury, you sucker. This is going to be fun. Just kill me. This I am killing you. I think you were the only one he had on the inside. Costello was gonna sell us to the FBI. Yeah. Oh boy. I just wanna go on record. 
I'm recommending William Costigan for the Medal of Merit. May his soul and the soul of all the faithful departed. What's she gonna do? No way she's sticking with him. Did you see that coming? I've already seen this movie. I did not see that coming. <laughs> what about the baby? <laughs> oh yeah, there is no baby for you. Okay. Very fitting, the rat. Is he still suspended or did he quit? <laughs> <laughs> well, I at least feel... God, this is, it's horrible. I watch way too much, much Dexter at this point. <laughs> at least justice was served there at the end. But, golly, you how many... He was going to get away with it? Yeah, I was a little bit like, that sucks. The bad guy actually gets away with everything. Even though he did the right thing by giving Costigan his... Funeral. Exactly, yeah. but still. Mark and Mark delivers in the end. I love it. Did not see that twist at the end coming. Like, totally blindsided by it. Crazy. Does that actually happen? To that ex to that Bob's? extent? Like, oh my gosh. Probably. Oof. Who was your? I mean, other than obviously, you're probably cheering for Costigan. Uh, Costigan. Yeah, of, of course. Yeah. Do you have a favorite side character? Or other main character. Who was your second favorite character? Marky Mark. Marky Mark. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He was like an just asshole. Just yeah. all the time to everybody. Yeah. yeah, exactly. He's no holds barred. Asshole. What do you think happens for his character next? What, what do you Marky think? Marky Mark. You think he's just bartending now somewhere? Yeah, probably. That off? Exactly. Really, just in the wind. Yeah, he's in the wind. How did he figure it out? You think that was in the letter? Oh, could be. Oh, yeah, yeah, probably. Because they didn't address the letter, so right. that must have been how that they were addressing so, it. Because, if something happens, Meek finds... Yeah, exactly. Because he's the only him. one that knows who he truly was, his true identity. Right. Right? So, yeah, that makes sense. I think this is probably Martin Scorsese's best film that I've seen. Yeah? Uh, just because tour de force on the cast, and yeah. just tension the whole time, because you're feeling everything that Costa gets feeling like... Mm -hmm. He's looking for a rat. I am the rat. Right. Right. You're feeling his anxiety the whole time. And then he throws a wrench at you and just sh outright yeah. shoots him. <laughs> Kills everybody. Yeah. yeah. Right. Yep. So, anything else on your mind? What's going through your head? Just can't believe that they killed Cost again. Yeah. yeah. All the main characters died. All the died. main characters, yeah. yeah. Crazy. No, it's good. It's a good movie. Mm -hmm. yeah. What should people comment on? Yeah, what was in Costigan's letter? Yeah. Well, it's it, got to be information from the starter, right? Yeah, it must be. Right? But what do you? What else do you think was in the letter? Like, an I love you? Do you think he said I love you? Yeah. Probably not. A little note for her? Right. right. Do you think the baby was his? Yeah, whose baby was it? Was it Sullivan's or Costigan's? I mean, statistics would say it's probably Sullivan's, but my heart wants to think it's Costigan's. Yeah. yeah. Anything else? That'll do it. Yeah. yeah. Like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for hanging out. Thanks for picking The Departed. Great movie. Yeah. And check out our Patreon link down below if you want to help us pick our movies going forward. If you want early access to our videos, full-length commentaries, and more, the link's down below. Check it out. Until next time, have a good one. Bye.